I just wanna live and let go and just lose control. Just lose control. Hi everybody, welcome back. So I have a really bad cold. It actually took me almost five hours just to get this done. I'm not feeling the best. It's not COVID. No worries. Been tested twice. Everybody in the house has been. Um, starting school, my son brought home a cold. It's like a head, throat, chest kind of thing. And I, it's been so long since I've gotten sick, period, that I'm not doing so well. <laughs> I'm being a big old baby about it. Um, my voice sounds different, and as I go on with the video, it, I might lose it. So I'm probably only going to film one or two videos this week because I need to rest and be able to take care of my children and deal with that first. Um, so I'm sorry, you're not going to see too much of me, but just know I'm resting and I'm getting better and I'm trying new things. Always working even if you don't see me. <laughs> if you're interested in my makeup or my jewelry, um, I have lots of snakes on today. Ooh. Anything, um, my makeup, like I said, anything, it's all down below um, in the description box along with everything we're going to talk about, which is some new makeup and awesome items and beautiful, I mean, just so much. So let's go ahead and get into our weekly Shop Miss A haul. This is two hauls in one, but they were small hauls, like two small orders put together. And I'm still waiting on three more. They just keep adding stuff. It's not my fault. Okay, let's start off with the best thing first, or the most exciting to me first, I should say. And that is their new lippies. Now I looked them up because I wanted to have the right information. And I looked them up, and they said that they are vibrant, full coverage, pigmentation, color payoff, hydrating, and they keep your lips soft and hydrated. Um, six complexion flattering shades, and they are non-toxic, free of alcohol, sulfate, and other dangerous stuff. Um, Cruelty-free, always. They look a lot like MAC lipstick bullets. And they come in so many cute colors that I bought all of them. Now, the weird thing is, is that each of these are, you can still get them individually, but I bought the whole thing, which saves you 5% off buying each one for $1. And that's sold out, so you can't buy them all together, but you can buy them separately. But I have all of them. Um, I will do some swatches for you guys so you guys can see and maybe figure out if there is one that is your favorite. So I'm going to take them out of this loud ass bag and let's go through them and look at them. So it looks like there are seven kinds and they are for the most part nude colored. Um, there are two that, I mean the bullets look the same color but I don't think that they will be. And then there's one that's more red. So they do give you a little bit of color. You got some pinks and you got a red and then you have a ton of nudes. Right up my alley. Right up my alley. They're all individually sealed. I love the bullets, by the way. That was a very simple, good design from them. I love lipstick bullets that look like this. Or the ones that are, like, so designing, like the khaki ones, that they're just beautiful. These ones are just... They look just like the MAC ones, only, you know, subtle differences and stuff like that. So I love the packaging, and then you have the name clearly on the back. This first one is Kiss, and that is a red lipstick. Wow. Woo-wee. So we will see how that is. And then up next, we have First Date, which I thought looked very kind of like pink and flirty and fun. I didn't know that they had all this unfun packaging trying to get them off. I am sorry. I'll be right back. Okay, now that I sort of have my life together, first date, 0566, beautiful. I could have wore that today. I really could have. And that's why I'm so excited to be hauling these is because I cannot wait to just start trying them out. Then we have Makeout, which I think might be my perfect color. Ooh, but they look, look how much darker they are compared to the bullet color. So don't go off of the bullet color. Go off of the swatches if, you know, you're going to go off anything because they're definitely darker. This one is in Charm. Ooh, I like that one. Ooh. 
people are liking these more and more. I didn't know. I thought because they were called the cloud pouts or something. I don't know. That's wet and wild. They're called cloud something. I thought that they would be more like that, like less pigmented. So to hear that they're full coverage, that's exciting to me. This one is in Lover, which is what I call my husband. <laughs> Oh, and it's probably gonna end up being my favorite peachy nude ever. Oh my goodness. I'm just getting more and more excited. And then there's Flirt. Flirt. Oh. <laughs> I like that one a lot. And then there's Fling. Fling. That looks like a little bit of a turd. <laughs> Ooh, but not inside it doesn't. Look at that. Oh. I love these shades. I don't think that there's a single shade here that I wouldn't wear on the daily except for the red one. But who wouldn't wear that for, like, everybody has a special occasion red lip. So that is the lipsticks. They are gorgeous so far. So I will be reviewing them, using them. You'll see. I'll let you know. Because if they're bad, I'm going to be really mad. <laughs> The next makeup item that I grabbed was from Just Color. I don't have a lot of um, positive things to say about them and their stuff. I haven't found a lot of hits there. This is their nude palette, but they're, this is number two. I believe that there is either one more or two more. Sorry, Alexis listening to me again, and she shouldn't be. It's, it gets weird. But this is the palette that I got. I'm waiting for her to talk to me. But this is the palette, and it's all shimmers. I think that you can get it all shimmers or another one that's all matte. I'm not positive about that, but these colors just look great, so I grabbed it and hoping that I find something from Just Colors that I actually like, so that would be nice. And then, you guys, the last time that I did a haul um, and the last makeup kind of get ready with me that I did, I told you guys I've been using the Malibu Glitz um, liquid highlighters and bronzers for my inner corner highlights. And that's exactly what I've been doing every single time lately. I cannot get enough of it. So I went on the site and bought every single other one that I don't have. So I grabbed this one, which is copper. Look at that. Could you imagine that in the inner corner with a warm look? <sighs> and then I got Frost, which is just more it's a white without an undertone because I have two of these one is a pinkish undertone and one is a blue undertone so this one is just like a white and then we have this one which is called bronze pretty close to copper only a little toned down on the sparkly and then this one that is called sand which I would probably use a lot on the kinds of looks that I do that is a beautiful color and then this last one here which is true gold and it's really weird because it looks green and yellow at the same time I think that's so good like these those are so good I have found that they're only good for me personally for wear like inner corner highlights or you know maybe a little cupid's bow highlight that you really want to stand out I would not use them as a bronzer or a highlighter as they say that they are or a liquid eyeshadow because when you place it and it dries, if that skin moves at all, it cracks and it won't look good in any other situation, you know? So, I, well, maybe if you like rubbed it out, but I don't know. I don't use it like that. I use those only for inner corner highlights because they make your inner corner highlight game like skyrocket to the moon. So I love them. And I grabbed every one. I don't regret it. <laughs> I did also pick up, this is another repurchase. I got another four blades for my AOA um, shaver. I do really like this. I think the blades, they get they tarnish um, or rust, I should say, I guess, um, a little quicker than I would like them to. But I've kept it out of the shower and people were right. It does last longer that way. So I just went ahead and grabbed this. Um, I believe that it's only a dollar for four though. So that's not bad. I picked up a couple more. Three, I believe, of my jelly jams. Because I kind of have been going through them a lot. This one. Oh, all three of them. All three of them? Strawberry, strawberry, strawberry. Yep, I got all three in strawberry. I have a lot of honeys. So, I needed something else for when I'm not feeling like I want a honey, I want a strawberry. 
<laughs> eyelash wise I picked up it's gonna be no surprise I picked up three more willows I'm not kidding that these the ones that are $1.55 um and then the ones that are in willow are by far my favorite lash all together throughout the line um I am wearing the bionic lash today one that I haven't tried and I forgot the name of it um but I did buy one as well and this is Bia B-I-A this actually looks really, really good. So this might end up being a favorite. That looks really beautiful. Really beautiful. I'm excited about it. Okay. So the last um, couple of things that aren't jewelry here, I will show you guys. And these were new on the site that they just launched. And they were their, like, makeup mirrors. This one here is $1.88, and it has eight times the magnification. Eight times. It's so dirty been sitting for a minute but it's also got cups so you can suction this anywhere that you know these kind of suction cups will stick and then you have a mirror that like literally oh you can you can see every problem in that mirror <laughs> and then I got this one which was probably just a dollar because yeah it was just a dollar this is the AOA five times magnification so this one isn't too bad and it has little mini suction cups too so I grabbed both of those because I always need a mirror. Always. And I, I can never find one when I need one. So I like to place them throughout areas. <laughs> Alright, and the last thing we have is some hair stuff and some jewelry. So if that does not, if that's not interesting to you, then I'll see you guys in the next one. But if you are, then let's get into it because I got some awesome stuff. The first thing, I got these two scrunchies. They're black and they have the letter D on them. And that's the only reason why I bought them was because they have the letter D on them. Because my husband's name is Dana. Starts with a D. I thought it was cute. I thought it was cute. Um, I got more hairpins. I got a lot more hairpins. Because I'm not kidding when I tell you how much I like these and how good the quality is. I'm going out and every time I see that they add new ones, I buy them. So I bought these two, one in green. The green is beautiful because it's got like a, almost like a white swirl in it and then black. And they come with their own different set of, you know, different kinds of hairpins there. And then I got snake ones. <laughs> yeah, I did. I did. And I should have put these ones. Nope, that's gold. Put these ones somewhere in my hair today. Oh, I'm wearing the earrings that I just recently got from Shop Miss A. I got these in gold and silver. They're snakes that float around in the middle of the hoop. I am I love snake jewelry. But I don't like snakes. Hypocrite. I'm such a hypocrite. Okay, so I picked up two of these. So one is going into a giveaway. But this is like a layered necklace that has suns on it. And I thought it was really, really pretty. So there's two suns. And like one chain stays up here then you have one sun and then one sun that goes down further so I thought that was really cute and I'll be able to put one away for a giveaway and then I also got another one that I tried to take the plastic off and everything just went wrong everything just went wrong with it so let me just take it off completely so you can see what this looks like they're pretty nicely made but I don't know uh, yeah, I don't know. We'll look at how how quick it takes it to tarnish. But this is just like a gold, you got a gold one here, and then this that has a spike, and then a circle at the end. And I really, really like that one, so I'm definitely going to be trying it. Oh, here's more hairpins. I got one in brown, too. I love them. I have the white ones. I have probably every hairpin that they have on the site I have bought. I even actually bought rings this time. Um, I'm probably going to have to put clear nail polish on them so my fingers don't turn green because I do have that problem. But maybe not because it clearly says that they are stainless steel on the tag. But then it also says they're size 17. And what? That would be like the size of my wrist. <laughs> because my ring finger is a size 7. Like, but anyway... These are just gold crosses. They're just gold crossed um, kind of rings. Gold cross rings. Just like that. I know it's probably hard to see a lot of it. Um, the next thing that I grabbed because it was super cute. Everything is getting so stuck together. But this I got because I'm a Murphy. Luck of the Irish, yo. 
<laughs> but these come with two clovered earrings and then the clover necklace and I thought it was too cute to pass up and then this this is gorgeous this is a heart with lots of rhinestones in it very it looks very like expensive and pretty and really really nice the earrings that come with it are horrendously cheap so those are probably gonna immediately get thrown away but this heart is so beautiful if i can find it i will link it i highly recommend it if it hasn't sold out yet i also grabbed this gold chain it's like a locking i have like a michael kors just like this this is okay quality but it wasn't the best quality i'm not like oh, about it it's a little cheap but not too bad and then I also picked up these earrings here that have small circular hoops. I think I have them in silver, so I just wanted to get them in gold as well. And then I picked up in gold and silver these hoops that are like textured. I, they're so pretty, my goodness. Oh, I just want to wear everything. And then I picked up these because they're coated. It's so weird. I've never seen earrings like this before, ever. They're like a half hoop with three lines and they're coated like a silicone. There's white, pink, and black. So cool. So I definitely had to grab those. And then the last thing that I grabbed was these earrings here. And they have um, a citrine gem at the bottom that hangs. It almost looks like, um, like a clothing pin or whatever they're called. The pins, bobby pin, whatever. Um and then the top and then the gem hangs down off from it and it's loose and those are the orange kind of like citrine colors because that is my birthstone color i've always hated it my whole life that <laughs> my november um birthstone was the topaz that's orange and i always was like why do i have to have orange i hate orange now i'm starting to appreciate it a little bit more so that is everything that i have picked up so far i cannot wait to get everything else in i think i'm going to wait until i get everything else in to do one big old massive final haul here until they get a lot more new items on the site um i will leave everything that i have shown listed down below and of course keep an eye out for a giveaway that's going to be happening soon when it comes to shop miss a so everything about me and the items down below give this video a thumbs up if you do want to see more shop miss a if you're not annoyed with it let me know what you want to see used reviewed you know all the good stuff in the comment section below i love hearing from you guys thank you so much for watching and I am going back to bed now. <laughs> Bye, guys.